It's pouring rain. Oh my gosh. What the heck? Where did this come from? <sighs> Good morning, guys. We are downtown in Montreal right now and it's pouring rain, which is really weird because when we came down here an hour ago, it was like totally fine. Sorry. I guess just that's just how the weather works though, right dad? I guess. <laughs> Makes sense. I'm so hungry. Did you eat? Not yet. Oh, uh, are you hungry? Yeah. I'm starving. Go home make some breakfast. Mm. It's really coming down. It's pouring. Woo! I don't even know if you can see. That's, that's so this is what we made for breakfast. Alex has a little bit of Greek yogurt with some granola. Some really nice gluten-free bread with, what is that, blueberry jam? Or uh, black, black cherry. Black cherry, oh my god, that sounds good. Some eggs with pepper. I made myself some eggs with cheese and hot sauce. We're each having a banana. Well, I'm putting the banana in my... Uh, oh, you're gonna cut yours I out. I think my eyes are hungrier than my stomach. Maybe. My stom Wait, is that what the thing is? Yeah. You might, not, you might not finish everything, but if you don't, I can eat it. And I'm probably gonna make myself some Greek yogurt after I finish my eggs. I just was really hungry and needed to eat. I couldn't keep making stuff, I was too hungry. So guys, we are headed over to my house currently just to hang out for the day because it's super rainy and according to the weather app, it's supposed to rain all day. It's a 90% chance of rain all day. If it sounds like I'm talking a little bit weird right now, it's because I have a piece of wax stuck on my tooth because I have a cut on my lip. I think I said this a few days ago and it keeps rubbing on the corner of my tooth. It's the worst. Like it's in the worst possible spot. And so every time I talk or eat or move or do anything, it rubs on the corner and keeps getting cut open more and more and it won't heal. So I've been putting wax on my tooth to like make it smooth so the cut will just like rub on the wax and it's not getting cut anymore. But it makes me talk a little bit weird because it like rubs my tooth. Here you guys can see. Mm. It's all my tooth there. But yeah, it's raining all day, so we'll probably just stay indoors. I don't know. We're gonna try and do a workout at my house, maybe in the basement or something. Sounds like you just got like a retainer in. <clears throat> I know, it sounds braces. weird. It sounds like I have braces again. It's really helping because now I actually feel when I smile or talk or move my lips, I can feel like the wax blocking the cut and it feels a lot better. So yeah, that's us. That's our plans for today. It's very rainy and it's a holiday for most people, so there's a lot of people out on the road right now, which is rare for a Monday at, at noon. Mm -hmm. Normally it's a lot more quiet than this on Monday at noon. But it's good, I'm actually really happy that it's raining because it's gonna get rid of all that leftover snow and dirt that's on the side of the road and in the grass. And you said it's, it's gonna snow tonight. Well, it said mix of rain and snow tonight because uh -huh. it's supposed to go down to three degrees overnight. So even if it does snow a little bit, the rain is so warm that it'll help wash it away. But yeah, the rain does definitely help clean, like even the cars. Yeah, exactly. It cleans off all the dirt from the car. And helps the trees grow. It helps the trees bud and grow their leaves. So yeah, The only snow that's left is like in the parking lots, all the big piles yeah. that are pushed from the snow plow. Yeah. And um, yeah, that's all I see is like the big piles of snow that are like brown. Yeah. They're so condensed with dirt. Snow's almost gone though, but probably gonna snow next week again. <laughs> well, it snows in April and everyone, but it doesn't stay on the ground. Yeah, usually we'll have a big snowstorm in April, at least once. So just finished cleaning up my whole room. I wiped down all the tables and my bureaus and stuff. I vacuumed. Sheets are cleaned, made the bed. Feels good. Feels like a nice afternoon well spent cleaning. I mean, I didn't spend the whole afternoon cleaning, it's only been like the last hour or so, but it still feels good and I still got the wax on my tooth. Mm. Yeah, you can see it right there. So it's still making me talk a little bit weird, but it's helping because my cut is healing and I can feel it, it's not getting rubbed on anymore with my tooth, so that really, really helps. I also just wanna say thank you because I was sitting downstairs with Alex earlier and we were looking at the giveaway and the feedback so far has been amazing. You guys have been really, really supportive and a lot of you have seemed to enter it already and it's only been up for an hour. So I'm really, really excited about that and I'm hoping if you guys enjoy it that it's gonna turn to a monthly thing because I think that would be really good for you guys to give back because you guys are what makes this special and what makes this fun. Spreading the positivity and spreading the happiness that this channel is about has been an awesome journey so far And we're only three months into it and your guys' feedback and every time you guys tell me how much it helps and how much You've been thinking about it and working on it and stuff. It just it makes such a good difference and 
I just want to say thank you so much for all the feedback so far from the giveaway. It really makes me feel good. We're watching a really old school project movie that my brother did for French class. I think in elementary, maybe high school. No, it was definitely school. like grade 7 or 8. Pro yeah, probably high school, like grade 7 or 8. Oh my god, it's so funny. It's so cute. I saw it on Facebook and I commented, like I tagged Alex in it, and I was like, we have to watch this later. It's too funny. <laughs> Tim, Tim's Gollum. He's so cute! <laughs> is it just me or does my face look weirdly blotchy right now so we are at dan's and um i don't know if we talked about it before but the video from yesterday is killing it right now how many yeah, views i did uh, i talked about it a bit i talked about it at like one so it's almost 5 p.m now and it's almost at 2,000 views? No, 1,500. 1,500? I mean, obviously we don't do videos for views, but it's just crazy to see, like, the spike. So it seems like you guys are really loving the giveaway, so I think we're going to continue with that. Um, let us know in the comments down below what kind of products you'd like to see in the upcoming giveaway. <laughs> in the upcoming giveaway as well. I mumble so much when I talk. Sometimes I, like, think faster than I'm talking, so I, I tend to mumble because I'm not, I'm not slowing it down. I need to work on that. Hmm. Um, so I was thinking, obviously clothing, because you guys seem to love clothing, but I was also thinking of, like, beauty products. I can go to Sephora and do, like, a little small thing, maybe once every two weeks. But something also that's not just towards girls, because we do have guy viewers. Like, there's, I think, 15% of you guys are male. Well, we could do, we could do, like, iTunes gift cards. We yeah, do, like, we can do gift cards. Stuff like that. Yeah. So if you guys have any suggestions, definitely let us know in the comments, because I'm... We're both definitely open. I said definitely like three times in the same sentence. But we are both open to whatever kinds of things. Obviously, we'll still do fashion ones, beauty ones. But if you have any other ideas, that would be fun to know. And also, if you have any other video ideas. Like, we were thinking of doing like being boozled and just like fun challenges. Maybe another Q&A. 
because obviously we love the vlogs but we still do want to do once in a while like sit down funny videos and challenges and stuff so whatever you guys want to see from us totally let us know i'm also super super stoked for new york city i'm going there this weekend um as a like a road trip with my sister and then my friend Catherine is actually flying in and meeting us on saturday so that's really really fun and i'll make sure to obviously vlog that i'll send the clips to dan but i'm gonna definitely be vlogging more and i'll also have like a main huge vlog on my channel for like the following week and how are you guys liking my hair i really like it a lot i like that it's like no more yellow i just i haven't washed it yet so i'm curious to see what it's gonna look like it feels like straw because that happens every time after I get my hair done. I just don't want to wash it because my roots aren't that greasy yet. So I'll wait till that gets really bad. Currently still pouring rain outside. I really want to go for a nice long walk today, but doesn't seem like that's going to happen. It's supposed to rain all day. And I wanted to run outside as well. That's not going to happen. But I'm going to do my squats for the day. Because I'm doing a 30-day squat challenge. It's like an app that Sophia told me. And it's freaking hard. My butt's killing me today. Oh my god, I have a cut on my, the inside of my mouth, Dan. Mm -hmm. Ow. Every time I talk, it cuts into it. Ooh. Annoying when that happens. <laughs> mm hmm. Look who it is. Mr. Panda. Mr. Panda. <laughs> what else are we doing? I feel like today's such a boring day. Do you guys? Like, there's, no, there's nothing we can do about that. It's pouring rain all day. I know. Do you still enjoy these vlogs, even if it's just us not doing anything? Because that's literally our life right now. I can't even film because the lighting is so dark and my studio lights that I have are just so yellow like I can't stand using them so I need to invest in like a, a ring light or something for days like this. It's just normally in the summertime the weather is so bright and beautiful so I never feel stressed on getting lighting but I really need to up my video game I feel like. I don't know. What are your thoughts? What are your thoughts? Yummy! Some um, sweet potato. Made it mashed with some veggies. Gonna be real good. Did you put some of those hot peppers in the den? Yeah, I put ones? one. Yum. Look how good this looks. There's jalapenos, red pepper, onion, yellow pepper, like that's sweet. What else did you put in there? Onion, garlic, cheese. Uh, that's it. And then he's adding some Greek yogurt. Good morning guys. So totally fell asleep last night and did not finish the vlog, but dinner was amazing and we just sort of sat down and watched Shrek the third and we both fell asleep. It's funny, sometimes the days where you're not really doing anything, you still end up being tired at the end of the night and just falling asleep. Uh, but my cut is still hurting tons, so I'm gonna go wash it and then put more wax on my tooth. But probably before I do that, I'm gonna finish editing today's video. Well, yesterday, today, I mixed video uh, and then upload it and then I'm gonna go have breakfast then I'll put the wax because when I put the wax I can't eat because it gets in the way. What I want to say is that today I noticed um, this morning while I was editing that today is actually my 100th video and I'm not really doing anything <laughs> exciting. So what I decided I'm gonna do is on the 100th vlog because we're coming up on 90 give or take because it's been about three months about 30 days a month because January is 31 then February is 29 then March will be 31, but it's not quite the end yet. So we're coming up at like 85, 90. So I'm gonna keep track, and when I get to my 100th vlog, I'll probably do something special. That's a really cool accomplishment I find. It's been 100 days in a row of vlogging, so I'll probably wanna do something really special for that. Maybe a challenge, maybe something funny. I don't really know, I'll figure something out. Got about two weeks to figure something out for that. But I just wanted to say thank you for watching today's video and thank you for all the feedback and entries for the giveaway. It's really cool to see how many people are interested in doing the giveaway. And definitely going to stick with monthly for now because it seems like you guys really enjoy it. If you did enjoy today's video, make sure you give it a big thumbs up. Make sure you subscribe down below so you don't miss out on any of our videos. And I just want to say before we go and end the video, I just wanted to, guys, to get you guys thinking that sometimes we can look at another life or another thing and think that, wow, look at how gorgeous that is or how beautiful that is and I wish I lived there or I wish I had that or whatever. But sometimes what we have in our own life can be just as amazing and we just have to remember to look for it like you know for us we forget that we live in the beautiful city of Montreal that other people probably would love to visit we live by the water we have a lake we have a beach we have you know changing seasons we have beautiful snow and then beautiful fall and spring and summer and sometimes we often forget how blessed we are and how lucky we are to have 
what we have in our life. So remember that you can find beauty in anywhere. You just have to remember to look for it. And you don't have to look elsewhere to find happiness. It can be right in front of you. So I hope you guys think about that just a little bit before ending the video and have a wonderful, wonderful day. And as always, we'll see you tomorrow. Bye.